And another ball. Foul ball there. The count two and one. And that one clips the corner. Left hand batter waits. That one fouled off. Two two now. That smash towards center. Makes the grab on the run. And there's one down. And now it is JT Real Muto. Known for Real his rocket Muto. arm behind the plate. Swings through that one. 0 and 1. Bounced up the middle. On the run, throw to first. Two up, two down. Reese Hoskins stands in for the Phillies. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Two down, nobody on. And that's outside. The wind to kick the 2-0. Hoskins pushes it foul. The 2 1. That one in there across the letters. And a pitch. Swings and sends a rocket to right and makes the play, and that's out number three. Phillies go down quietly in the inning as the lead remains 3 1. New inning getting started. So now here's the Mets DH. J.D. Davis. Wheeler back to work. Swing and a ball hammered. Left field. Back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. He was all over that first pitch fastball. Just barely missed it. Man, this guy was ready to hit. At the plate. Eduardo Escobar. One for two. Jack swing went around. Strike one. The why to kick the pitch. Well struck right field. That one carrying and brings it in at the wall. Every day during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of balls in the gaps. They practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfectly. This to third. Boom. Throws out to first, and that is that. Back at Citizens Bank Park, and now the center fielder, Odubel Herrera. The Phillies, the center fielder. Okay. And there's the strike. Oh, there's a pitch we haven't oh, seen in a while. It's going to be tough on the hitters if he can mix that in whenever he wants. And that one fouled off. The 0 2. Stays alive. 0 and 2 now. And misses inside. Recognize that changeup right out of the hand. Just spit on it. Next <laughs> offering in the dirt. It's two and two. Man, he's been really good. About to hit that 100 pitch mark here in the seventh. Man, we'll see how far they're going to ride him, but it's been pretty good so far. And there's a hit. Off to a good start with a leadoff now. Just one of those scene I base. Hits through the infield. He just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find a hole and get you enough. And here comes the Mets manager to the mound. Pitching change coming. Seth Lugo will take over here. The offense will need to be ready for the breaking stuff. He's got a great curveball. Stubbs stands in now and watches strike one. Next offering misses. 
and the count is one and one. Got no base hits in the series for him so far, and it's clearly been a rough one. You just hope he's not pressing too hard because that just compounds things. It makes the slump even longer. Never seemed to help. Never helped me. Line drive, and out number one on the grab. Gene Segura stands in for the Phillies. Herrera runs. Shoots a line drive single into right center. Oh, he botches it. Herrera around third. Now a long throw home. It's offline. The run comes in. It's 4-1. Alec Bohm stands in for the Phillies. Now batting. In there, and it's 0-1. Segura, the base runner at first with one out. They say it went. Next pitch misses, and the count is one and two. Now a high fly ball out to left center. Canna racing over to make the catch. Man at first, and now for the Phillies, the Nick Castellanos. And yeah, that's in there for strike one. Some guys are just more confident if they can track that first pitch out of the hand of the pitcher. They don't care if they fall behind 0-1. And the 0-2. Out towards right center field. Nimmo makes the catch, and that'll do it. So one run in the inning on this base hit. It's now a 4-1 ball game. Welcome back. We're at the top of the eight. And stepping in for New York, Luis Guillorme. That one out to right. And it's foul. And the right hater deals. Fought off foul. Flew open a little bit with that front shoulder, but was able to slow his back down just enough to make contact with that pitch. Keep the bat alive. Slow roller up the middle. Fires over to Hoskins. First out in the top of the eighth. Good slider inside right the there. Catcher. Batter Number fighting two. to get there. Just the rolled boss. over it. Got the ground ball. Into center. Pereira has this one sized up. Pulls it down, and there's two gone. Now at the, the plate, Jeff one. McNeil. Second baseman, Jeff McNeil. Up the middle, what a stop. Fires to first, and very nicely done for the out. Down in order, go the Mets. And this is still a 4-1 ball game. Back here in Philadelphia, now here is Kyle Schwarber. For the Phillies, the designated hitter, Kyle First pitch, not close. That's down and in. Next one misses, and that's ball three. The pitch. And there's ball four. Second walk of the game for him, and he's been really patient at the play, the game plan that he's sticking to. He's just not going outside of what he's looking for up there. Throw back in quickly. First and second now with nobody out. And digging in for Philadelphia, JT Real Muto. And first off, Ring is fouled off. Real Muto. Schwarber, the lead runner out at second. Gregorius at first with no outs. This one in the dirt. No movement on the bases. One and two the count. One, two now. Got him looking. One gone to the bottom of the eighth. No, that's not the best two-strike fastball I've seen, but certainly got away with the location there. You know, sometimes as a hitter, when you're down in the count, you're so focused on a pitcher painting the black, and you just get a little bit locked up on something down the heart of the plate, not expecting it, and it just kind of freezes you. Lifted in the air, out to left. 
Canna under this one. And there's two down. Rose to second. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there. That front shoulder coming open now instead back. of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle the other oh, way with Herrera. some authority instead of a fly out to left. Odubel Herrera stands in with two away as he takes a ball. Two outs, a couple of base runners at first and second. Next offering is foul back. He's mixing his pitches really well late on that fastball after seeing the changeup. See if he can elevate one. I think if he does, he'll get the swing and miss. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. Phillies leave a couple as they hold on to a 4-1 lead. Out of the bullpen for the Phillies, Corey Knievel. He's been so good against lefties. And stepping in for New York, Brandon Nimmo. One for three. The pitch. And first offering is fouled off. They say you win. And a pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Here's the 0-2. That's a laser base hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. All over that one right there. Got a fastball, middle of the plate, jumped all over it. Absolutely smoked that ball. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. And here is Starling Marte. Swings here and blasts one left field, and out of here. A big blow to the home fans. Third home run of the season. It's 4-3. A good hitter gets pitch recognition early. He saw exactly where that was going to be. The challenge, not get over anxious and come out of your swing. He stayed on it and got all of it. And now it's the polar bear, Pete Alonso. Now batting, the first baseman, Pete Alonso. Fouled off, he was late. Can be tough to bounce back after a big home run, but nobody on, nobody out. You just have to treat it as a fresh inning. The tying run at the plate. Swing and a miss. That is strike two. Looking to get the tying run on base. And takes low for ball one. Crowd locked in right now. One run game here in the ninth. Next offering is foul back. Just missed. If he's able to connect on that, look out. Righty delivers. Chases that one out of the zone. And that's the first out. Now it's J.D. Davis. Now battle. The designated hitter. J.D. Davis. First offering, misses the mark. This is the guy they turn to to get the most important outs of the ball game, but they're going to make him work to get this save. And a pitch. And that one is lifted in the air. That's bad. He can't get there. That should be extra bases. 
Throw to second, not in time. He's there easily. Well, that at bat had a lot of pressure riding on it, so really great job coming through right there. It's got to feel good. Chance now to even the score and maybe extend this game. They turn things over to the southpaw, Brad Ham. A runner on second. Hard hit down the line and left. And it one hops the wall. Huge game tying at bat right there. Came through yeah, in a bad. big spot to drive in the run. Ripped that one down the line and kept it fair. And even when you hit it that far out front, you still have to keep your hands tight to your body so you don't hook around that baseball and put it in foul territory. And that right there was perfect. Now a huge at bat in this game coming up. Canna swings through it for strike one. as he waves at that row. If you're a base runner, you've got to stay dialed in here. Look for anything in the dirt. Try your best to get in the scoring position. And a swing and a miss. Now two out. Now it's the shortstop, Luis Guillorme. The bat, number 13. Shortstop, Luis Guillorme. Next pitch has popped up. Gregorius brings it in, and that'll do it. Back here, Citizens Bank Park. And now the right fielder, Garrett Stubbs. Leading up for the Phillies, the right fielder, Garrett. Going along. Well, they kept him pretty quiet in this series. Still doesn't have a knock. I know you want to get that first knock out of the way. Maybe more will come. But you got to give some credit to the pitching staff. They've had a great plan against him. The next pitch misses. One ball, one strike. 4-4 four, four in the ninth. And a swing and a miss there. Spin rate's outstanding on that high fastball. Really tough to hit. That one pulled foul. Tied at four. Stays alive. Starting to get some pretty good timing on that breaking ball, but he's going to have to stay ready for a fastball. Don't want to watch one go right by you. Next one just misses. Now. is a big first out. So the Philly batting order turns over. No and here's the Phillies leadoff two. man, Gene Second Segura. Gene Segura. And first offering is fouled off. All tied up here in the last half of inning number nine. Line drive, base hit. Now he'll turn for second. Here's the throw. Makes it to second. The winning runs in scoring position with one gone. Got a good pitch to drive. Stayed short with his bad path to the ball. And time is called for a mound visit now. Big moment in this game, so they'll talk it over. The Mets with a new arm on the mound, Trevor May. Hasn't pitched in a while. He's had the last five days off. Boom. Swings through it for strike one. One away. The winning run at second. And he's down 0-2 as he swings through it. Not a swing you want to watch again. Next pitch has popped up. Nito under it. Makes the catch. And there are two outs. Got the pitch that he wanted just a little bit quick. Front Number shoulder eight. open. Backside collapsed a little bit. And the launch oh, angle, no, no. not where he needed it to be. Nick Castellanos stands in with two away as he takes a ball. And the 1-0. And he pumps it a strike. 
No need to offer at that pitch until you get to two strikes. It's just a low percentage of success when you want to try to go after that down and away pitch. Alonso steps on the bag. That's out number three. Philly strand one. This game's all tied at four. Making a move at second base, and here's now the pinch runner, Janeshwi Fargus. Number four. Back here Janeshwi. in Philadelphia, we're in extras here. Tomas Nito with the plate, and here it comes. Out there to center, Pereira gets there. He's under it, pulls it down, and he makes the catch. Runner tags up for third. Better batter now. Jeff McNeil. Good contact yeah. guy, good defender. McNeil. Some bullpen action for Philadelphia. Connor Brogdon, the young right hander, up and throwing. Coonrod getting cranked up as well. Two balls, no strikes to count. In the infield at the corners, don't be surprised to see them come home first. And prevent that run from scoring. 2-0. Hard hit, left side. Oh, look at the stop. High throw to first, and he can't reach it. Safe. And they take the lead. Oh, this has been a good, tight game so far, but now that air error looms pretty large. I gotta think that's gonna weigh on him for a little while and Unless somehow they can come back and win this thing. Man. Swing and that ball smashed on a line. That's down. One hops off the wall. In its second, no play. A run comes in on the play. First pitch swing in, went up there with a the plan to be aggressive. Off the, the bat, it was headed for the six. gap all the way. Oh, and as a hitter, you love seeing those head. as you take your first couple of steps out of the box. You know you've got some real estate to run on. and such a good feeling. Nice liner into the gap right there. New pitcher on now, Connor Brogdon. And his job is to collect quick outs and keep his team within striking distance. So he's having an excellent season so far. ERA is under two. A lot of flexibility coming out of the bullpen. And that one hammered. That's back. Hits the fence. One run is in. Gregorius with a relay throw. Not in time. He makes it safely for an inside the park home run. The first baseman, Pete Alonzo. And here's the first baseman, Pete Alonzo. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Still only one out here in the inning. This to center field. And there's two away. Two outs.
Lifted in the air right center field. Herrera drifts towards it. And that's the inning. Chance the evil Francisco Lindor. He's the new shortstop as he comes in as a defensive replacement here. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Now it's the DH, Kyle Schwarber. And the first offering is not close. Stirring in the Phillies bullpen, Sir Anthony Dominguez. Up and loosening in the pen, Coonrod getting loose as well. At the belt and fires. And it is two and one. Kicks and fires. And a foul ball. And he deals. Just off the outside edge. And the count's full. Left hand hitter waits. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. Swing and a miss. And he got him. And they get the leadoff man in the tent. Here's Didi now. He's already homered in this game. How about it? That one back up the middle and it gets through. Castellanos on his way to the plate. Play it home. He's safe. It's eight to five. Well done. Narrows the deficit with the RBI there. Really nice job staying up the middle with his approach. He didn't try to do too much with the pitch. Just shot it through the infield and you can feel this crowd waking up a bit here as the guys are starting to make some noise with their bats so they turn to edwin diaz out of the pen and this guy can bring it velocity wise And here is JT Real Muto. First pitch, just misses. There's the strike of the knees. Gregorius stands at first with one out. And one and two. Just a really nice slider down and in there. He wants to get the hitter thinking fastball, speed him up, and just subtract some velocity and add a little movement. Here comes the pitch. Swings and lines a base hit into left field, and it bangs up against the wall. Coming home. He'll score, and it's now a two-run game. These guys today are so great with handling velocity. They're seeing high speeds day after day, and a nice job of turning that one around. Hoskins in the box now. Takes strike one. Hoskins. Comes up empty on the swing. 0-2 now. Yeah, Boog, if you're that base runner at second base, you want to be quiet out there. Not bouncing around, not distracting your teammate, the hitter. Make sure that he can clearly focus on that pitcher and that release point. So two down oh, now, and down. here is Odubel Herrera. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Herrera. Just off the outside edge. Two outs and one in scoring position. Swings and misses. And it's two and one. Next pitch has popped up. He puts it away, and that'll do it. The Mets win the rubber match of this three-game series. Well, this is a big win on the road and going extras in 10. Uh, so hard to pull those out, but I think this team did a great job of keeping the crowd out of the ball game late. When you can do that, it kind of calms everything down, keeps the adrenaline of the opposing team down a bit, and you can steal a win and get out of here happy. Final score of 8-6 to six in this one for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Chum. Thanks for joining us.